What we're doing here today is stocking about 65,000 small juvenile red drum as part of our stock enhancement program. We've been stocking fish with the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources for about 25 years and we're focused in on red drum of this very small one inch size because we know that they do really well in the wild when we stock them out. It's very important for us to stock fish for a couple reasons. One is that we not only increase the wild fish that are in the population, but also because we learn lots of information about red drum in their natural habitat in the environment. We harvest fish from saltwater ponds at the Waddell Mariculture Center. We haul them in our specially designed hauling truck here in back of me that's equipped with oxygen. And we bring the fish to the landing and we transfer them, transfer them into boats and we carry them out into the high marsh and release the fish in, a, in an area where they're able to disperse at high tide to avoid predators. Um, the Department of Natural Resources has worked very hard and long on their stock enhancement program, both in Charleston as well as the Waddell Mariculture Center. And we have what we believe is to be one of the most sophisticated stock enhancement projects in the country. We, we stock four different species of saltwater fish. All of our fish are genetically fingerprinted. The DNA from the adults were able to then understand when we go out and capture fish from the wild in subsequent years as to whether they're a wild fish or they're a hatchery fish. In addition to that, it provides us a lot of information about the wild populations that help us to better manage red drum populations and other saltwater fish populations in South Carolina.